Today is Christmas Eve, so please join me for my take on the night before Christmas 2023. It was the night before Christmas, so please journey with me as we take a look back at 2023. In the UK there's fears, something unknown yet sinister. We've done a whole year without changing Prime Minister. For American residents, there's a whole new adventure because it's clear that their president has got senile dementia. And the one thing that's worse than Russian Vladimir Putin is the never-ending curse of militant Muslims. And now they pray in the streets instead of their mosques, but they all drive taxis and their prophets are nonce. And the pro-Palestine demos that take place almost daily, did they not get the memo, you don't fuck with Israelis? At Christmas, our thoughts are of our nearest and dearest but this year's been quite short of conspiracy theorists. Microchips in the vaccines, remember those twats? They've gone back to their old scene. They still think the world's flat. Social media's been a library, but with just one agenda. Folks saying, I'm non-binary, or look at me, I'm transgender. To the men in women's clothing with makeup on their faces, the world owes you nothing. Get out of women's spaces. But I feel so empowered wearing women's short shorts. And I get to watch girls in the showers and dominate women's sports. No, enough is enough. We've heard too much of this shite. And if you think your year's been rough, at least you don't own Bud Light. Let's do something nice. They wondered insanely. Will it hurt the share price if we use Dylan Mulvaney? But the year's biggest tale is one of invasion. As the small boat set sail, uncontrolled immigration. These army service aged men, if they fled for their lives, then where are their children? And where are their wives? And bleeding heart lefties cry, we must give them a chance. Why, they're not refugees. They've come over from France. They're not intellectually arousing. Haven't come to share with us their wisdom. They're after free housing and the benefit system. Fascist, xenophobic, you're just racist really. I say, not a bit of it, but if you come here, come legally. I forgot the values and plans of the year 2023. I'm a straight cis white man, so that makes me a Nazi. But it's been a good year for me, and I'll try to be modest. The band released an EP, Rise of the Goddess. Sicily was beautiful, but one thing made me frown. The heat was so brutal that the airport burned down. My other holidays were great, although they were closer to here. I've been to the lakes and Derbyshire, and I went north of England to a place like no other, the capital of Scotland, the city of Edinburgh. I worried a lot, though I needn't have panicked. It turns out not every Scot is a heroin addict. And I hope you'll allow me to say Vorsprung Dirk Technik, because I now drive an Audi. Yes, I'm one of those pricks and light-hearted banter is what this channel's about. I wrote my letter to Santa. I hope he brings Nita Strauss. And as he waits up in Lapland and prepares to take flight. Happy Hanukkah, Merry Christmas, and to all, a good night.